The construction of the penguin robot is mainly divided into four parts. 1. The base part. 2. The body part. 3. The arms part. 4. The electronic part. Step 1. Assemble the base part. Take out the 2-beam 0410-186 and 2-beam 1030-32. And then fix them with 8 hex head screws M4 multiplied by 1 0 and nuts. The first beam 0410-186 is fixed in the first screw hole and the other is fixed in the fourth screw hole. Note that the screws and nuts do not need to be fixed too tightly when they're initially fixed. They need to be kept parallel. Step 2. Assemble the beam 1030 to 100. Take out two beam 1030 to 100 and fix them vertically with two hexagonal screws M4 multiplied by 8. Step 3. Fix the 1030 assembly to the base part. From here, the seventh hole, centered. 2M4 multiplied by 20 screws and nuts are needed here. And one side needs 4 2mm nylon spacers to support. These 8 nylon spackers act as support to prevent the beam 0410186 from being bent by the screw. The construction of the base part is completed. Next, let's build the body part. Step 4, assemble the slide beam 082432. Here we use the beam 1030100B and the two slide beams 082432, symmetrically mounted, with two screws M48 on each side. Step 5, assemble the beam 0410 frame. Connect the second hole in both ends of the beam 0410106 to 2 beam 0410130 to the first hole of beam 0410130. Connect the second 0410106 to the fifth hole of beam 0410130. Secure with a screw M414 and a nut. Step 6. Fix the 0410 frame onto the slide beam 082432. The first hole of slide beam 082431 corresponds to the position of the third hole of beam 041130 and is fixed in parallel. Here we use screw M420 and nut M4 to fix.
The second screw is installed with one empty space. In this way, the body part is initially completed. Step 7, Assemble DC Motor. Align the screw holes of the motor of 25 motor bracket, and fix them with counter sunk screws M36. Step 8, Assemble DC Motor to the frame. The two holes of the motor module are centered on the frame and fixed with screw M4A. In this way, the entire body part is ready. Step 9. Connect the body part to the base part. Pay attention to the direction here. Fix with screw M4A. The base part and body part of the penguin robot are set up. In the next step, let's build the wings of the robot. Step 10. Assemble the gear portion of the wing. Here we need to use two 560T plastic gears, two beam 0410106. Both sides of the gear are assembled in the same way. Then we assemble the beams 0410130 and beam 0410154. Here we use screw M435, 210mm nylon spacers and lock nuts. Note that there is a certain gap that can be rotated. The fourth hole of the beam 0410154 is locked by the first hole of the beam 0410130. We use screw M414 and lock nuts to fix. When fixing the gear and the beam 0410, add two 3mm nylon spacers on each side. Here you can fix it first. Or adjust to a different angle to make a different shape, and then fix it. The wing here is probably like this, and the installation of other side is the same way. Step 1 1, attach wings to the body part. Here we use two screw M414, screw M35, four flanged copper bearings, four nylon lock nuts, four 6mm aluminum columns and two 3mm nylon spacers. Mount two copper bearings on both ends of the gear, and then put screw M435 pass through the copper bearings. A 6mm aluminum column, a 3mm nylon spacer. The third hole of the beam 0410106. Another 6mm aluminum column and fix the nylon lock nut in the end of screw. Then fix the beam 0410130 to the body part. The first hole of the 0410130 beam is connected by the third hole here secure with screw M414 and nut. The wing on one side has been completed, please assemble the other side in the same way. Pay attention here, do not lock the screw too tight, keep a certain space to rotate the gear. Step 1 2. Assemble 8T plastic gear. The shape of hole matches the shape of flat motor shaft. Let's fix the gear with a screw M24. When installing the gear here, we must first adjust the two wings to the same direction. The flat surface of gear hold should be aligned parallel to the flat surface of the motor shaft.
mechanical structures are initially finished. Now let's install the electronic parts. First let's assemble the RGB ultrasonic sensor. This RGB ultrasonic sensor is like the eye of the penguin robot. This sensor can be used as an RGB LED or as an ultrasonic sensor to detect distance. There are three holes here, we can assemble with two holes only. Assemble RGB ultrasonic sensor in the middle of this beam 0410 with screw M410 and nut. Fix by the first and third screw hole on sensor. Next let's assemble the mainboard elf. We already introduced this part in the previous video, it's same here. Be sure that the USB port on the main control board is facing up, so we can plug in the USB cable smoothly. Use 4 screw M48 to connect mainboard elf on beam 1030100B. Next, assemble the battery holder. The battery holder has two screw hold, use screw M410 to fix it on beam. Step 1 for is wiring. We need one DC power cable, one 20 cm RJ11 cable, and one 35 cm DC motor wire. Firstly let's connect 25 DC motor to mainboard motor port M1 by 135 cm DC motor wire. Then let's connect RGB ultrasonic sensor to mainboard port B by the 20 cm RJ11 cable. From here, it is connected to the RGB ultrasonic module port. One end of the power cable is connected to the battery box, and the other end is connected to the power connector of the main control board. Our penguin robot is now completed.